our physical bodies have laws that are governed by proper nutrition. Nevertheless, people have a hard time sticking to a healthy diet. By applying the principles of how a habit is formed, we can develop healthy eating habits that last a lifetime. Welcome to Be Fit Be Health channel. In this video, we want to invite you to have a look on a practical approach to healthy eating. Don't forget to subscribe today and bring the bell on so you don't miss out our latest video inspiration, tips, recipes, and amazing journey to help our body health. I have been doing push-ups five days a week for over 25 years. My arms are pretty strong, but it did not happen overnight. I did not do push-ups for a couple weeks or months and then stopped. I had to make push-ups a habit if I wanted to continuously get the results I have. Exactly the same holds true with healthy eating. You will never be healthy, eating healthy foods occasionally. You have to make healthy eating a habit if you want to obtain nutritional health. People jump on the bandwagon of healthy eating when they read books or view websites that talk about nutrition. While many of these books and websites tell you what you should eat in order to be healthy, they fail to teach you how to make healthy eating a habit. Thus, in a short period of time when temptations come, people fall right back into their old unhealthy eating habits. What is a habit? According to Webster's Dictionary, a habit is a behavior pattern acquired by frequent repetition or physiologic exposure that shows itself in regularity or increased facility of performance. Can you see that if we simply apply this principle to healthy eating, we will be on our way to vibrant health? Bad eating habits. Bad eating habits do not develop overnight. For most people, these habits begin forming when they were kids. Thus, one reason why many adults have a hard time breaking their bad eating habits is because these habits have been a part of their lifestyle for many years. Why do we eat food? There are two main reasons why we eat food. One is to supply fuel for our body. The other reason is for pleasure. Unfortunately, some of the foods that give us pleasure are unhealthy. Most people make their food selections based on what they see, smell, or taste. Look at these three sentences. That pie looks good. That pie smells good. That pie tastes good. Notice that all three statements involve food and pleasure. However, the food that is producing the pleasure in this situation, the pie may or may not be good for you from a nutritional standpoint. That is why we need to be wise in our food selections and not simply leave it up to our sense of sight, taste, or smell. Eating healthy can be enjoyable. Some people think of eating healthy as being boring and tasteless. I think that one reason they feel this way is because most of the commercial ads we see promote foods high in calories, fat, or sugar, and only a small percentage of food advertising is done for fruits, vegetables, grains, and beans. Thus, if there was more nutritional education, more and more people would find eating healthy to be pleasurable and tasty. How Healthy Eating Habits Changes Life It is great to be in good health. However, we do not believe that I am healthy because of chance. One main reason that we are healthy is because we take personal responsibility for our health. Making healthy eating a habit is a great part of this responsibility. Our physical bodies have laws that are governed by proper nutrition. If we violate these laws by consistently eating unhealthy food, we are going to get sick. If you found this video useful, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Be fit and be health and see you in the next one.